guys last video i'm recording today it's a very small indie haul everything of course is swatched already so let's go on and get with it first polish first polish i regretted not getting from the polish pickup after i saw it i i just wanted this polish like my favorite is silver blue um gray and blue and i don't know why i passed this up i don't know if maybe i just didn't buy any polishes that polish pickup or if there were others that caught my eye more than this i don't i don't know because i try not to buy so many from polish pickup sometimes it's really hard um but yeah i don't know why i passed this up and thankfully um, I posted in the Polish Pickup Buy Sell Trade on Facebook and somebody messaged me that they had it and I snagged it right away. Um, I actually had no money so I went through my de-stash or through my collection and found polishes that I wanted to de-stash and I got the money for it. <laughs> Not that she charged a, a ridiculous amount, she charged a normal amount. Um, but I just didn't have any money at the time. I was broke. I think I probably bought something else. Um, I, who knows? I don't really know. We're always buying polishes. But anyway, this is Luna from Painted Polish. And it is a gray Corelli base with those beautiful blue to purple aqua multi-chrome flakes. You may have seen in my other video, um, um, my speckled polishes that I had purchased Polish for Days Aquata to try to calm my want for this in case I never found it. But, oh my God, I'm so happy to have it. Here it is, swatched. And it looks so much better in person, guys. Don't let my swatch... Um, deter you i'm sorry if you guys want this also and you can't get it go to the polish pickup buy sell trade group on facebook and you just might get lucky like i did i'm in the market now for um poetry cowgirl sing them good i think it's called Ugh, another one i passed up on that i i really shouldn't know next up is a new brand um out of texas is magnolia beauty company and this one is called sirens song mm. and this is a beautiful um sea foam green blue shimmer some flakies are in there this is a topper though um and that's kind of what i topped everything before so here i have three coats over white which is what prompted me to buy this to begin with I saw somebody swatch with it over white and it just glowed and I thought oh you know what that'll be perfect for like my icy green prompt on my ponies polish parade um however it didn't it doesn't look exactly as I expected it to um the swatch picture is different than this but it's okay it's still very pretty over the white and then I did do it on its own and of course, it's it's just very sheer. So you need to do it over some sort of a base. And I did it over the green, and it gave a blue shimmer. And I did it over a blue, and it just gave a little shimmer. Over white or black might be your best. Next up, I have two Schlee polishes. Schlee has become one of my fastest growing favorite collections. Um, my favorite indie maker. She does these awesome... You know, they're, they're so packed full of shimmer. My only problem with her is the, <clears throat> is the fact that a lot of her colors kind of are in the same color family. Um, the same kind of... Like, they're all so beautiful. So it doesn't really matter because they're packed with the shimmer. But, you know, like I showed you in my flakies or my speckled polishes, the two schlees that I had there. They were just so similar in base color. Um, but that's okay. Yeah, you know, but sometimes it's a pain when you buy a polish because it looks so beautiful for the shimmer. And then it's similar to something else. Sorry. Sorry, guys. 
So this one here, and a lot of her polishes, again, like I explained in the uh, speckled, oh, sometimes she re-releases them, sometimes she doesn't, sometimes she'll release them as a 2.0, but many times, if you see one you like, order it, because it may not be restocked. This one is called Psychic yes. Winds, and it is a gray base with that beautiful pink shimmer you've been looking at. Here is two coats on my nail wheel here. And I probably could have done a third coat, and that shimmer would have stood out a lot more. That is Psychic Winds, and it's actually more on the nail of a taupey color, which is also fine. I don't care. <laughs> this next one, oh my god, guys. <laughs> this next one is so freaking adorable. Now, I didn't get any of the the glitters, but, um, oh God, it's gorgeous. This is called Easter Bunny, and this is a clear base with that beautiful pink shimmer she uses, and then there's circle glitters, there's bunny glitters, and then, I know the bunny glitters are hard to see, because they're not. She gives you a baggie full of the bunny glitters. <laughs> Just in case you don't get enough in the polish. And it's not that I didn't get enough in the polish that I didn't get any on the swatch. It's just that the bunny glitters are going to, you know, you're going to have to fish. But this is just gorgeous. There's a bunny in there. You see him? Here he is. Here's the bunny. There's the bunny. <laughs> So here it is. I did it over a black. Here it is over black. So you could see the pink shimmer more. Mm -hmm. uh, and apparently I got doggy puppy hair on here. Okay, that's much better. There's the pink shimmer and all those beautiful pastel circle glitters. There's hollow glitters in there. This is just beautiful. I think there's even a scattered hollow in there. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. This is the cutest polish I own. And sorry guys, it'll be going nowhere. <laughs> I will wear this for years to come with the cute little bunnies for some glitter placement. Um, not sure if she'll re-release it on Friday because um, you won't have it in time for Easter. So it may just have been a limited release. Although she may release it again. Um... You know, so that people who missed out can get it. I'm not really sure. There's also iridescent yeah, glitters in there. You can see them. Okay, so that's it for me, guys. I'm done filming for today. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. Not like you're going to get to see them all at once. But <laughs> I hope you've enjoyed hearing me ramble on about stuff. And let me know down in the comments what you think, what you thought, what are your favorites. Um, do you go to Polish Pickup? Um, has there been a polish that you saw on polish pickup and later regretted not buying? I want to hear all about it. Um, so yeah, please leave me comments. I love to respond and I love to see everything you guys say. On that note, have a great day. Um, yeah, enjoy the spring because, you know, summer's right around the corner. Huh. I'll talk to you guys again soon. Bye.